What's up, mortals? Bringing you uh, part two today, and uh, here we go. Let's see, still chapter one, but uh, we'll see how far we can get today. Probably finish the chapter. Hopefully, I don't know. We'll see. I'm doing this. In the oh shit! The fuck? You all right, buddy? All right. Well, Isaac, be there careful. We go. Shooting them in the body didn't seem to work. I cannot Both explain to you guys how excited I am for Dying Light to be coming out next week. I actually uh, took off the afternoon of work just to play it a little more, get uh, get a little used to it, get some more videos out for you guys. This does not look good. Shit. Credits. Okay. Like, this is the creepiest place you could be. Stasis module, finally. Uh, this is like a lifesaver whenever you get swarmed out. I love this thing. There we go. I'm telling you, dude. Elevator, doors, closing doors, all that. It's the best weapon in the game. You can't stop it. Oh, shit. Looks oh, like shit. that door is malfunctioning, oh, Isaac. Shit. Try using the stasis module you just this picked is not up. Good. Okay, there's something down here. Fuck, fuck. It's so damn dark. Shit. Shit. Okay, okay. There we go. Go to the repairs. This is not gonna be good. Your stasis module should be able to help you with that arm mechanism. I have to turn that on. There we go. Some on the wall for us, guys. Now, I've been looking at a lot of games for uh, 2015 coming out, and I gotta say, a lot of the really good ones are gonna be either the begin coming out like February time right now, February to March, but then after that, it's like nothing until. Oh, shit. Nothing until like that November rush, you know, December, kind of Christmas time. So I don't know, like, especially in the summer, I'm gonna let me do that. Especially in the summer, I'm gonna have to find some good either PC games or just something out there that I can play, get, get going with. Maybe do some uh, longer series of games. Just do kind of the, there's so many games that nowadays that are uh, kind of just open world games where you can explore a lot more. There we go. So, I mean, if you guys want to see that, just let me know, because I'd definitely be interested in... Because uh, when I play those open board games, like uh, said, uh, Shadow of Mordor, it's pretty Isaac, much just amazing. You did game. it. The sure. tram is walking the whole system. When you get the computer online, you'll be able to call the tram from the control room. Faster the better. I can't see them crawling around. It. Oh shit, 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 shit. Slow motion. I love the slow motion effects. This looks amazing. I can't wait to jump to two though. Some cool shit. Oh, okay. But, um. Yeah, when I play those open world games, you guys, I'd really just like to, um, play and. I usually don't even do the main objective for a little while, like the main story. When I do, if I do play it for my channel, I'll definitely make sure to go about and go through that as quick as I can for you guys because I want you to see the bulk of the game. But usually, I just like to get the player built up and do all the objectives and not have to really. I just like to beef up the guy and make him a little bit stronger for when I actually do the missions. It just makes it more enjoyable for me to go through and just dominate all that. I don't know how you guys like to play, what kind of games you all like, if you like those open world ones that they're coming out with nowadays. It's just uh, it's a shift. I mean, it makes a longer game for you, honestly. Shit, shit, shit. It makes the games so you can, uh, it's 
It's weird because it makes them so you can't like. There's like no end to the game, honestly. Like in reality, you can play the game forever, but uh, at the same time, that's kind of boring. Unless you're playing like GTA Online, some people enjoy doing that, and you can do that at time after time, and not to worry about it. System. But uh, it took some work, but I've got the door to the maintenance. I don't know. I and I like the Switch. They give you a lot more choices in games, but then again, sometimes it can be just. I just want to sit back and like the old time games where you honestly just. You go one path and that's it. And that's all you gotta worry about. And uh you don't gotta you can just relax and enjoy all that's going on in the game. Everything, not to worry too much about it. Here we go. Gotta go do this for these guys. Oh shit, I need a data board. Let's see where I'm not going the right way. Whoopsie. Wasn't really paying attention too much. Sorry about that guys. Um Keep going. Yeah, and I'm just trying to get my setup going too. Right now, I don't have uh, my headset connected because uh, it's a little quirky with the. Uh, oh shit! Ah, motherfucker. Damn. Oh, there's a lot of stuff here. I don't need to save. I don't need to save. Yes. Okay. But, uh, I don't know. I use a. Uh, what is it? Elgato HD. Because I have a Mac, and that's pretty much the best compatibility for it. But uh, it was it was a little weird. I had to get it all hooked up, and I play on a projector right now, so it was different plugging it into that, and then getting all the um, getting all the audio to work correctly was just a big challenge, honestly. Isaac, shoot, it's Kendra. It looks like the door to the storage room is locked. There should be a key somewhere in the maintenance bay. So I'm just gonna be messing with the settings a good bit, and. Uh, Getting all that figured out so I can bring the best possible gameplay for you guys. Oh crap, I feel like there's about to be a lot of them in here. Hello. Shit. Come on. That, uh, just line them up, you know? That's all you gotta do when you wanna kill them. Just line them up. Ah, oh, I should shut that. Whatever. Um, fucking in the vents. Have you guys played that game, uh, Alien Isolation? I haven't got to try it yet, but it looks really good. I mean, it's a little bit older game. I just recently got a look at it, but definitely something I'd like to try out, for sure. I'm going the right way. I think I am. I played this mission before. I can't remember all the ins and outs of it. I know there's probably going to be a bunch of this shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get away from me. Get the fuck out. There we go. Come on, bitch. Come on. Bring it. Bring it. Fuck it. There we go. Nice. Get the little box. I got plenty of parts. Holy fuck! See, I don't have my headset in right now, so it's a little difficult to play this, honestly. I need to get that figured out. I just started doing this, so... I don't know, it's a new device for me. I've used the older Elgato before, and I used to have a Turtle Beach, but that doesn't work anymore, so... Just trying to get all this figured out now. Oh, fuck. There. I mean, these games are, like, so dark. It's just... That's where they get you with the jump scares. It's, it's crazy. You gotta get out of here. Well, let's go. Well, let's go. So what games are... Oh, what games are you guys really excited about uh, seeing... 
this coming year. Just uh, if you find this video, let me know. If you find it, uh, I don't know how long. Um, I mean, I plan on doing this for a while, but uh, no matter what year it is, just let me know what, what video games you're excited about coming out. And I'll probably come back and comment back on these if it's a later year or whatnot. But uh, definitely interested in seeing what kind of games you guys like to like to play and like to like me to play as well. So just kind of get a feel for the audience, people that kind of watch these videos and get kind of a... Oh, here we go. Here we go. Bench. Definitely got the bench. Yeah, you got that Oh, I should upgrade. Damage capacity. Loads. Okay. I feel like these just take a while to get going in this game. Stasis as well. I just like to get the um the plasma cutter upgrade a little bit, you know. There we go. Power node. I'll come back to the bench later. No big deal. More shot. No, I'll do it now. I'll do it now. real quick. Still got time. Let's see. Plasma cutter. I'll just do capacity as well. Just get a get a upgrade on that. Take the board back to the cram control and slot it into the computer array. Then take the cram system back online. Shoot the limbs, shoot the limbs. Always be reloaded in these games. Shit's scary as fuck. Oh, God damn it! We'll get all that figured out soon enough. Shit's creepy as fuck. There we go. And the cargo lift. Take me away. Oh, shit, shit, shit. But, um. <coughs> Peter! Petey! Sorry, guys. That's, uh, Petey. I have a puppy and he, he gets excited sometimes. Oh, shit. Dead? Yeah, drop some stuff. Me drop some good stuff here. Yeah. yeah. PD, calm down, it's okay. Oh Peter. But um definitely gonna be getting into some uh more of like playing some Silent Hill kind of stuff for you guys, getting all those good games going, some uh more jump scare kind of games. But uh, looking forward to a lot more of the PS4 and next-gen games as well, because the graphics on those are amazing. But I'll also be visiting some old-school games after uh, this kind of February and January rush of games comes like to a little little break. But uh, we'll see. We'll see how things go. Ah, oh, here we go. There we go. Get the tram squad. Hell yeah. All trams now operational. Tram at oh, the trams. How I love you. Alright, well guys, I think I'm going to save in a second when I get the chance right, after this. Alright, we're and heading for the bridge. Good work. Strange. The quarantine just lifted. Whatever was in the flight lounge must have left. That's lucky for us. Isaac, get back to the Kelion and prep it for launch. We'll find out what we can from the bridge and meet you there. If we live that long... You're out of your league, Hammond. This is suicide. We're going your to die out here. Your lack of confidence in me is duly noted, Miss Daniels. But I have a mission to complete, and that's exactly what I am going to do, with or without you. Do we understand each other? Just get us out of here alive. Well, I just want to say uh, thank you guys for watching. If you're definitely keeping up with this series at all, or you find this later on. Uh, but, uh... Uh, yeah, I just gotta get a few things sorted out. I gotta actually get back to work. I'm on lunch right now, but, uh, I will m probably get another part up this afternoon. Um, my plan is to get through at least Dead Space 1, probably Dead Space 2 by the time Dying Light comes out, and then, uh, 
I'll finish off the trilogy whenever I get a chance to make it around Dead Space 3, depending on uh, how fast, how long I spend on Dying Light, because uh, I'm going to be ordering uh, the Order 1886, and that comes out uh, January 20th, or February 20th, and then uh, I'm going to also, I have a whole list of games that I'm really interested in on under my channel on the About, if you guys want to take a look at that. But uh, thank you guys for watching, if you like it, just uh, go ahead and hit a like, favorite, and uh, subscribe if you definitely want to see some more of this, some more of the new games coming out for sure. But uh, thank you guys, and stay more.